but you cannot take pictures on the site itself. Can I just, what, even the Travel Lodge guests can't take pictures? Really? Do they all know that? Yeah, they all know that. Wow. So, welcome back to the channel, guys. Today, we're here in Acton, taking a look at this place here. Now, it's not very often you see a travel lodge being secured like this. So I do believe there's a lot more going on behind here. Uh, we have got Segro signs being secured by Segro. Oh, and we have G4S approaching right now. Right. Yeah, it's pay online. Just go to the barrier and let them know what you want to do. Yes, can I help you? No, I'm okay. Actually, it's a private estate and you can't take pictures on here, I'm afraid. And that's through the authorization through the management team can't take pictures no right i didn't know that yep okay um so what happens next then are you do you want to do anything on the site itself yeah yeah i just what? want to just want to make a video about the uh, the industrial estate because you've got um you've got quite a few businesses that, that are interesting on here you've got vmi tv okay well, if you have an arrangement with the guys inside, fair enough, but you cannot take pictures on the site itself. Can I just, what, even the Travel Lodge guests can't take pictures? Really? Do they all know that? Yeah, they all know that. Wow. Um, so, as long as I do it from here, then I'm okay, because I'm not you actually- You can't take pictures on the site, boss. I'm not on your site. Wait, well, you can't take pictures here. It's, they don't like it. You can't take pictures. Well, I have traveled all the way from Leicester to do this video because there's some in businesses on here yeah, well, I'm that are interesting you to you me. You can't do any video in here. Am I on your site right now? Indeed. So where does your site end? Where the bar where the front entrance is. Um, so te technically you are trespassing by the law. Uh, right, I might be able to do it from You can't take back pictures there. of our site boss. They don't like it, I've just explained that. Yeah, I know, but what I'm trying to establish is how can I continue, right? So if I stand at the traffic just lights, just there. You'll, you'll need to speak to the supervisor. So he's gone to get the supervisor. He's still not happy with my compromise of standing at the traffic lights. So this road really is a public highway because it leads to travel large and i'm sure he says it was a, a car park of some sort so let's find out i am happy to to go to the end here and do the video and take the drone over but let's see how this pans out i can't hear you I can't hear what you're saying. I can't hear what you're saying. Well, that's fine. I said, how are you doing? You all right? Yes, mate. Yeah, yeah. yeah okay, what was the purpose of video on the side? Just because you've got some businesses that are here yeah. that I want to put on my YouTube channel. VMI TV Limited is one of them. Okay, just give me a second. That's okay. VMI TV camera rental established in 1979 based in London. Yeah, I think they're the best person to come and see you. Yeah, they're coming. Yeah, yeah, that's brilliant. I'll wait here. Thank you. VMI.tv. Okay, okay. Alright, cheers, buddy. Okay, bye. Hello. Hiya. It's nothing special. I just do YouTube videos on industrial estates and I show people where places are located. So you guys are in the camera rental market and you've got a great website, but no one can see where you're located. So I just do a little video to put on my YouTube channel and make it as interesting as I can and fly the drone around. And I don't think we would actually, because I don't own the estate, I only, I only rent the building, so I don't think I could actually even allow that myself. Well, I, I don't think even my bosses would allow it, so. I'm not actually you asking to, for permission. I'm just 
security came over and asked me what I was doing. So mm. I've just told them. And that's led to this point, them calling you. Right, and nothing with them then, then. It's nothing to do with me, is it? It's to them letting you on, on the estate. There's a security factor to the estate, so I suppose that's down to them. Yeah, yeah. I, I just said to them, um, I'm happy to do it from the end, because I'll fly the drone over, you see, because you're just behind here, aren't you? Well, the thing is, yeah, it doesn't matter. I mean, if you wanted to film our building or yeah. know, know where we were, yeah. it's called Google. <laughs> just... Yeah, but Google Street View didn't go on here, did it? It doesn't matter. If anyone wants to know who we are, they come and see us. And yeah, if nothing, you've got to talk to them. If they won't let you on, that's down to them. Shall we just uh, relay to these what we've said? Don't let him on. Don't let him on. That's to do with me. So w the conclusion of that conversation is he doesn't give any permission for his building to be filmed. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to return to the public highway oh, oh, and take the drone over so that I can film it with the drone. That's the only way I'm going to get the footage I need, all right? OK, well, I'll be outside. So that's that. They wasted a member of staff's time to come out and talk to me when he just says, look, I do not have the authority to say yes, which we knew anyway, but security wanted to proceed in that way. So that's what happens when you communicate and you try and work with them. Really, you should just say, look, just leave me alone. I'm going to go where I believe is a public highway, which is out here and carry on my lawful activity. And if you don't think it's right, then stop me somehow. <laughs> but anyway, out here, let's get David up and let's see what this place looks like from above. So as always, we've checked on drone assist. We are in the EGR 160, which does not apply to a 249 gram drone. In fact, it only applies to manned aircraft like helicopters. So the Victoria Industrial Estate, home to many businesses, including VMI TV Limited. Let's have a look at you then, shall we? Home point updated. So we're not going to go very high at all. We'll just stay at 30 meters as we enter the site that they're so desperate to protect. Although it has a travel lodge right just there and literally anybody can go on. Crazy, isn't it? So let's jump over to the industrial estate behind where we believe VMI TV are based. And it looks like they are over here somewhere. I'll just make sure I can still see the drone. So if I just cross the road, that will give me a little bit more. There we go. So if I go forward a little bit more, then just there, that is my max. I'll just show you. You can just see me standing over there. So let's find VMI TV, shall we? There they are. So unfortunately, we cannot get any closer than this, but if you could just see it in the distance, they do have a few solar panels on the roof. They are the only company actually with solar panels on the roof. Yeah. But they have a very large turnover, very nice cars in the car park. That is their building. So let's get nice and high pull back a little bit so we can see exactly what else is in this area that's the access road and security are guarding the whole lot for them we have a train track directly behind a good mixture of buildings around here including that big baby there have something to do with hs2 going off over here we'll have a look at that shortly we even got some conveyors taking the waste away but that's that 
Let's get David back and see where the video takes us next, because that was Victoria Industrial Estate. And that was the Victoria Industrial Estate, home to London Acton Travel Lodge. And whilst walking along the path there, we stopped just there. As you saw, security believe they have the authority to tell us what to do. We gave them the benefit of the doubt because whether it's a public highway or not is debatable. So we removed ourselves and we came out here where we was left alone finally. The VMI TV had a great opportunity there to get some free publicity. I just want to show people where you are based because, you know, we've looked on the website. We just cannot see it for ourselves. So quite interesting. It's also very interesting to hear G4S point of view, which we all heard exactly what he believes. So that's it. The location of the DJ Audit's keyring on this video is underneath that stone just there. If you are one of the first people to watch the video and you do want a key ring, good luck with that. And we're going to move on. Victoria Industrial Estate here in Acton. Video complete. If you have enjoyed that video, do give it a thumbs up for me. And I'll see you on the next one, guys. Bye-bye for now.